tests for magnesium ion. Magnesium is a chemical element with the symbol Mg. It is found in various salts like magnesium chloride and magnesium sulfate as magnesium 2 positive ion. In group 6, magnesium ions form a precipitate of magnesium ammonium phosphate with ammonium phosphate solution. Our aim here is to test for the presence of the magnesium ion in a given salt. First, we look at the preliminary tests for magnesium ion. Dry heating test. Materials required. Original salt in a test tube. Test tube holder and Bunsen burner. Procedure. Take a small quantity of salt in a test tube. Heat it over the Bunsen burner. White residue glows on heating, indicating the presence of magnesium ions. Charcoal cavity test. Materials required. Mixture of salt and sodium carbonate in a watch glass. Charcoal piece. Distilled water. Spatula. Dropper. Tongs. Blow pipe and Bunsen burner. Procedure Take a mixture of a small quantity of salt and double its quantity of sodium carbonate in a watch glass. Take a charcoal piece with a small cavity in it. Using a spatula, place a small quantity of the mixture in the cavity of the charcoal piece. Using a dropper, add a few drops of distilled water to the mixture to moisten it. Using the tongs, hold the charcoal piece in front of the reducing flame of the Bunsen burner. Now, direct the reducing flame on the cavity by means of the blowpipe and heat strongly for some time. White residue which glows on heating indicates the presence of magnesium ion. Cobalt Nitrate Test Materials required White residue obtained in the charcoal cavity test Cobalt nitrate solution, dropper, tongs, blowpipe and Bunsen burner. Procedure Take the charcoal piece with white residue in it. Using a dropper, add a few drops of cobalt nitrate solution to the white residue. Using the tongs, hold the charcoal piece in front of the oxidizing flame of the Bunsen burner. Now. Direct the oxidizing flame on the cavity by means of the blowpipe and heat strongly for some time. Formation of pink residue indicates the presence of magnesium ion. Next, we look at the confirmatory tests for magnesium ion. Ammonium phosphate test. Materials required. Salt solution in a test tube. Ammonium chloride. Ammonium hydroxide. Spatula dropper and glass rod. Procedure Take a small quantity of salt solution in a test tube. To this add a small quantity of ammonium chloride using a spatula. Shake the test tube well. Using a dropper add a small quantity of ammonium hydroxide to the test tube. Then add a small quantity of ammonium phosphate solution to the test tube. Now scratch the inner sides of the test tube using the glass rod. A white precipitate of magnesium ammonium phosphate is formed due to the reaction of magnesium ions with ammonium phosphate. Precautions Heating should be done very carefully.